Assalamu alaikum viewers. How are you all today? Hope you are all okay with the good weather. You must be enjoying your gardens in this lockdown. Uh, so today I bought for you a recipe of Thai fish. Uh, so for that, first of all, I need fish. Any fish, what do you like? But I personally, when I had first time, I had with the sea bass as well, and this is sea bass. So it was full. I have divided in two pieces, and this is all spices. All spices uh, you find in any market. Everything. So I put in this bottle. It's for marination fish, uh, salt and black pepper and oil for fry. And then we have to make like a gravy. So for that I, I need onion, butter, uh, tarragon. This is lemongrass. I don't know, most of people don't know what this. I have chopped here, yeah? but I wanted to show you what is this. Lemongrass, uh, water. A coconut milk salt ginger and garlic and what else we need we need rice to eat with this I have already cooked in my rice cooker I'll put in description below it's so easy for me so in this rice I just put a little bit of turmeric black pepper and salt and water I cooked it and then I need this for strain uh, when I make gravy, I have to strain. So I'll go, I'll show you. Just come with me. So I'm going to start to do first gravy. I'm going to turn on my flame. I'm going to put my butter in. Let it melt. And then I'm going to gradually start to add onions, shallots. I have chopped it very in small size. My tarragon, my garlic, ginger, and I will cook it until all flavors get binded together. And then I'm coming back to you. Using this, and what I'm going to do, I'll pour uh, about half cup of water. So this mixture, it will be cooked all together in, to make a gravy. So, meanwhile this is cooking, it's just to make like a flavor. I'm starting to marinate my food. For fish. that, I need all uh, spice. It's not spice, really spicy. It's just name of this. It's all spicy. You can find everywhere. Salt. And black pepper. So, I'm going to mix all spices here. Oh, I have marinated this all. Now, I'm going to wash my hand first. And then, I'm going to check my gravy. See... I am trying to make a flavor of lemongrass, onion, ginger and garlic in this water. And then I'm going to strain it and then I'll add just the rest of the spices. So be with me, I'll come back. So we have to let this all to cook for 10 minutes to get enough flavor. It's starting to smell very nice, lemony because of is lemon grass so it's, yeah. today you know what happened um, we went in India two years ago and we met a friend in hospital 
Her name is Asma. So I think she had lost our contact and everything. And we also, because she, her mobile got lost, stolen. So now suddenly she called us and sh she made us all so happy because it, uh, we, we've been talking like a long time and then suddenly we stopped for a year at least, I think. So it was so excited and I did, I wanted to cook as well, but my time was like uh, to cook and I had, I was excited to talk to her. So I'm very happy to talk to her, uh, to Asma. Uh, thank you very much to be a part of our family. Um, and inshallah be in touch. Keep watching my videos as well. <laughs> yeah, so yeah. She loves so much my daughter. She said, no, she's like my sister. I love her so much. And yeah, like sometimes we we have a far relationship, but they are more closer than us. So it's like a, our family. And so ten minutes is ready. So you are you you see that yeah, like smells comes and you you feel that yeah. Uh, now the onion and um, tarragon, uh, I mean lemongrass, everything is there. So the flavor is, must be coming in. So now what what I will do? I'll strain in. In here, in here, and I'll leave again this, yeah, and I don't want this. This is now rubbish for me. Now this is main gravy. Yeah, so I'll pour this gravy in the same pot again. Yeah, I'm trying to make possibly my gravy smells so nice because it's a lemongrass. Look, oh. I'll pour a little bit more water, just a little bit. Yeah. Okay, so this process is ready now. Now I am going to add other stuffs now. I'm and adding here coconut meal is a one tin of coconut meal. Uh, salt, just according to your taste. And because look already, it looks yellow. You don't need to add turmeric, but for me, I just like little bit more yellow. So I just add little bit just a pinch of turmeric powder not much and what i'm going to do i'm stirring and now i'll add tarragon you can use a, um, this type of tarragon or fresh as well but due to lockdown is a little bit difficult to find stuffs so i'm using this tarragon so a combination of tarragon coconut milk lemon grass you just think how nice and flavor so this need to be uh, more probably 10 minutes to boil and the gravy is ready it will be looking yellowish and, and this is very yummy because i'll pour this on top of my fish and on the bottom of fish i'll put rice so what i will do now i'm going to start to fry my fish so in between my gravy will be ready believe me you serve this with the salad you never regret so i'm going to find the fry pan let it heat and then i'll start to fry my fish <coughs> don't fry fish in very high flame it will burn fry pan is hot now i'll pour oil here small amount not very big amount and i'm starting to fry my fish Possibly try to fry it in a uh, non stick so they don't burn. Yeah. Fry it for 3 to 4 minutes one side and then other 3 to 4 minutes other side. And look, my gravy. Look, colors changing. 
I cannot try unfortunately because I am fasting. But believe me, it's very yummy. Mm. So look, my, my gravy is boiling now. So it's nearly there. This is depending how thick and how thin you like. But it's okay, it's, it, it's uh, boiling, so yeah, it will let, reduce a little bit. Now look, my fish. I'm turning my fish now. They are very delicate fishes. So you have to be careful when you turn it. And look, oh my lovely. It so smells so yummy. Delicious. We we used to eat this food in Manchester. Uh, in a restaurant. And we used to love it. My husband said, I like this. We have to go to Manchester to eat this. We said, let me try and find out some Somewhere we will find out and the flavors and everything. And then we found, so since then, we make it home. So we don't need to go so far away. So yeah, so you know, we have to try to make everything at home as well. So, my gravy, my fish and my rice, all ready. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn off the flame. Now I'm going to serve the food. Um, in my plate and I'm showing you my plating. Shift the rice. Now I'm going to put the fish. Up here. One. I put another one in here. And the gravy on top here. And the rice and in the fish. So viewers, I am very sure you will like this when you make it. It's not very difficult to make. It's very easy and it's very less ingredients. So thank you very much for watching my videos. And please subscribe, like and please press the bell icon. So I come first in your feed. So Jazakallah, thank you very much. Have a good day. Bye-bye.